Hello and welcome to this session. In this session, we will discuss a question which says that a sample contains 20 balls. In the sample, 4 balls are defective. If 3 balls are selected as random, what is the probability that exactly 2 balls are defective? And what is the probability that all balls are defective? Now let us start with the solution of the given question. Now here we are given a sample of 20 belts and out of these 3 belts are selected. So the total number of outcomes will be choosing 3 out of 20 belts that is 20C3 which means number of combinations of 20 valves taken 3 at a time. So, total number of outcomes is equal to 20C3. Now, we know that NCR is equal to N factorial upon R factorial into N minus R whole factorial. So 20C3 will be equal to 20 factorial upon 3 factorial into 20 minus 3 whole factorial which is equal to 20 factorial upon 3 factorial into now 20 minus 3 is 17 so this will be 17 factorial. Now 20 factorial can be written as 20 into 19 into 18 into 17 factorial whole upon now 3 factorial is 3 into 2 into 1 into 17 factorial further in solving this is equal to 20 into 19 into 3 which is equal to 1140. Therefore, total number of outcomes is equal to 1140. Now in the first part we have to find probability that exactly two dots are defective. Now here we know that three valves are selected and out of these three valves we have to find the probability that exactly two valves are defective. It means we choose two defective and one non-defective valve. Now out of 20 valves number of defective valves are 4 and non-defective valves will be 20 minus 4 that is equal to 16 bells. So here we have to choose two defective bells out of four defective bells and one non-defective bell out of 16 non-defective belts. Thus, number of favorable outcomes for this event that is 2 defective and 1 non-defective belt will be choosing 2 out of 4 defective belts that is 4 C2 into choosing 1 out of 16 non-defective belts that is 16 C1 so this is equal to now 4 C2 will be 4 factorial upon 2 factorial into 4 minus 2 whole factorial into 16 C1 will be 16 factorial upon 1 factorial into 16 minus 1 
फोर फैक्टोरियल फर्दर दिस इज इक्वल टू फोर फैक्टोरियल अपॉन टू फैक्टोरियल इंटू टू फैक्टोरियल इंटू सिक्सटीन फैक्टोरियल अपॉन वन फैक्टोरियल इज वन एंड दिस विल बी फिफ्टीन फैक्टोरियल Now this is equal to now four factorial can be written as four into three into two factorial upon two factorial can be written as two into one into two factorial into sixteen factorial can be written as sixteen into fifteen factorial upon fifteen factorial. Now further on solving. This is equal to six into sixteen, which is equal to ninety-six. Therefore, number of favorable outcomes is equal to ninety-six. Now we have to find probability p that exactly two defective bulbs are selected. Now we know that probability p of an event E is equal to number of favorable outcomes for event E upon total number of outcomes. Now here, number of favorable outcomes for this event is 96, and total number of outcomes is equal to 1130. So. Probability that exactly two defective bulbs are selected is equal to 96 upon 1140. Now we know that 4 into 24 is 96 and 4 into 285 is 1140. So this is equal to 24 upon 285. Now in the second part, we have to find the probability that all bulbs are defective. Now we know that three bulbs are selected at random, and here we have to find the probability that all bulbs are defective. And we also know that out of twenty bulbs, number of defective bulbs is four, and number of non-defective bulbs is sixteen. So favorable outcomes for this event are choosing three defective bulbs out of four defective bulbs and choosing zero non-defective bulbs. Out of sixteen non-defective bulbs, so number of favorable outcomes for this event is equal to four C three into sixteen C zero. Now this is equal to four factorial upon. Three factorial into four minus three whole factorial into sixteen factorial upon zero factorial into sixteen minus zero whole factorial. Now we know that zero factorial is equal to one, so this is equal to four factorial upon three factorial into now four minus three is one factorial. Into sixteen factorial upon zero factorial is one. Into sixteen minus zero whole factorial, that is sixteen factorial. Further, this is equal to now four factorial can be written as four into three factorial, and we know that one factorial is one. So three factorial into one is three factorial into Now here, on calculating, this is equal to one. Further, this is equal to 
4 into 1 that is 4. So number of variable outcomes for this event is equal to 4. Now we have to find probability B that all defective wells are selected. Now number of favorable outcomes for this event is equal to 4 and total number of outcomes is equal to 1140. So probability that all defective bulbs are selected is equal to 4 upon 1140. Now 4 into 285 is 1140. So this is equal to 1 upon 285. So this is the solution of the given question. And that's all for this session. Hope you all have enjoyed the session.